so let's have a discussion on one more important theorem that is pair of angle bisector theorem so let me read the theorem statement the equation to the pair of bisectors of the angle between the pair of lines ax square plus 2hxy plus by square is equal to 0 is h times x square minus y square is equal to a minus b times xy or you can write uh, this is x square minus y square by a minus b equals to xy by h also we can write it. So that means first we need to find out the separate equations of ax square plus 2hxy plus by square is equal to 0 say that is l1x plus m1y is equal to 0 another one is l2x plus m2y is equal to 0 so that we can have l1 l2 is equal to a l1 m2 plus l2 m1 is equal to 2h whereas m1 m2 is equal to b after that so the equation to the uh, bisectors bisectors of the uh, lines l1x plus m1y is equal to 0 and l2x plus m2y is equal to 0 can be written as l1 plus m1 by root of l1 uh, l1 square plus l2 square and plus or minus l2x plus m2y by root of l2 square plus m2y square is equal to 0 then combined equation of these two we need to find out after having been actually substituted l1 l2 for a is equal to a l1 m2 plus l2 m1 is equal to 2h and m1 m2 is equal to b of the prior simplification we get h times x square minus y square is equal to a minus b into x y so that we shall get it so let us find out now proof now follows let ax square plus 2hxy plus by square is equal to 0 represents represents following lines following lines say one is l1x plus m1y equal to 0 equation 1 l2x plus m2y equal to 0 second we have this is very interesting here we get l1 l2 is equal to a and l1 m2 plus l2 m1 equal to 2h and m1 m2 is equal to b okay so now we need to write the equations equations to the bisectors equations of bisectors of angles between 1 and 2 are ok. So, L 1 x plus M 1 y root of L 1 square plus M 1 square plus L 2 x plus M 2 y by root of L 2 square plus M 2 square equal to 0 say equation 3 it is one of the uh, equation of bisectors of the angles between this a x square plus 2 h x y plus b y square is equal to 0 other one is see similarly L 1 x plus M 1 y root of L 1 square plus M 1 square minus L 2 x plus m2 y by root of l2 square plus m2 square equal to 0 equation 4. Now, we need to find out combined equation of 3 and 4. Let us find out combined equation of 3 and 4 that is the required one 3 and 4 means we need to find out the product of these two equations 3 and 4 multiplying 3 and 4 we get the combined equation this appears to be a plus b into a minus b a square minus b square directly we can write l1 x plus m1 y by root of l1 square plus m1 square 
whole square and minus this is b b for example b b a plus b into a minus b a square minus b square we get l2 x plus m2 y by root of l2 square plus m2 square whole square is equal to 0. Now we need to simplify carefully. This we can write l1 x plus m1 y whole square by l1 square plus m1 square minus l2 x plus m2 y whole square by l2 square plus m2 square equal to 0. So, multiply both sides with the multiply both sides with l1 square plus m1 square into l2 square plus m2 square. So, what will happen? If you multiply this one with this one, this l1 square plus m1 square, this cancels, this into this remains. Similarly, if you multiply this one with the second term here, l2 square plus m2 square, l2 square plus m2 square will be gets cancelled, this into this will get it. So, that means we get now, here we get l2 square plus m2 square l1 x plus m1 y whole square minus l1 square plus m2 m1 square into l2 x plus m2 y whole square equal to 0. Okay, have you followed? So, now let us simplify now here. Here first write uh, x square and minus y square of term and minus 2xy let us write because this will be a plus b whole square form. Here we get x square term, y square term and 2xy two, two term also. Here also x square term, y square term, 2xy their contributions we need to correct together. So, first we can write like this. So, x square of you see x square means here l1 square into l2 square, here also l1 square into l2 square and x square. Okay. So, that means we get like this now l1 square into l2 square. Uh, now, we can write like this l1 square into this much l1 square into this one that is x square coefficient we get like this see l1 square into l2 square plus m2 square very logic minus you can write l2 in square here change one l1 square and m1 square right on. let me explain see here x square coefficient is l1 square into this one here also l2 square into this one that we have taken common and minus y square of you can expect it now minus y square means here you see so here minus y square means you get m2 square into this one so m2 square into l1 square plus m1 square minus here we get c m1 square into m1 square into m1 square into this one l2 square plus m2 square and next minus 2xy term see minus 2xy means here actually we get 2 l1 m1 xy but 2 l1 m1 2 xy is taken common out l1 m1 into this here also minus l2 m2 into this we need to write so, that means minus 2xy common minus 2xy common we get L2 m2 into this first L1 square plus m1 square L2 m2 into L1 square plus m1 square and minus L1 m1 okay you can expect this one. So, what is the value here instead of 1 2 write down instead of 1 2 write down. So, we get L2 square plus m2 square. 
equal to 0. Now let it be simplified now. So x square of this we can write L1 square L2 square plus L1 square M2 square minus L1 square L2 square minus L2 square M1 square okay and minus y square of L1 square M2 square plus M1 square into M2 square. Are you following? And minus L2 square M1 square and minus M1 square M2 square. And one more term we have minus 2xy that is minus 2xy is equal to here see L1 square L2 M2 plus L2 M1 square M2 and minus L1 L2 square M1 and minus L1 M1 M2 square equals to 0. So now check each term carefully. Here what happens this both have will be gets cancelled here also these two gets cancelled. So now we get like this. So this can be written x square into L1 square M2 square minus L2 square M1 square and minus of y square L1 square M2 square minus L2 square M1 square minus 2xy. From these two take L1 uh, Better you do like this, better you do like this. From these two, L1, L2 you take it common. From these two you take uh, M1, M2 common. From these two if you take L1, L2 common, what do you get now here? L1, L2 common means L1, M2 minus L2, M1, it is clear. Okay. Now, uh, here plus m1 m2 take common. If you take plus m1 m2 common or minus m1 m2 also you can take it common no problem minus m1 m2 means minus uh, l1 m2 from this one minus l2 m1 okay you get like this equal to 0. So next simplification x square into this is in the form of a square minus b square a plus b into a minus b. So x square of l1 m2 plus l2 m1 into l1 m2 minus l2 m1 and minus y square into same thing l1 m2 plus l2 m1 into L1 M2 minus L2 M1 and here L1 M2 minus L2 1 L1 common we get minus 2xy into L1 M2 minus L2 M1 common is equal to 0. So if you take this common out we have L1 L2 minus M1 M2. L1 L2 minus M1 M2. See just carefully observe first term, second term, third term. So this is common, this is common, this is common. So this will be sorry this is common. Let us take common out. So if you take common out we get like this L1 M2 minus L2 M1 is common. We get this <coughs> L1 M2 plus L2 M1 of x square correct and this one minus of L1 M2 plus L2 M1 of y square and this is sorry here already taken common out we have minus 2xy into L1 L2 minus M1 M2 equal to 0. 
since it does not equal to 0 it goes that side now you get like this l1 m2 plus l2 m1 of x square this will can be common x square minus y square you can write if you take these two common out so now we have minus 2xy into l1 l2 minus m1 m2 equal to 0 by this you get 0. So let us replace respective values l1 l2 is equal to a m1 m2 is equal to b l1 m2 plus l2 m1 is equal to h. So we get 2h x square minus y square minus 2xy into a minus b equal to 0. Divide both sides by 2. We get h of x square minus y square equal to a minus b into x1 or this can be written x square minus y square by a minus b equal to x y by h this is the required equation.